Before it was the MGM Grand, it was the Mandalay Bay. Now it is the T-Mobile Arena, the most beautiful arena in the world and the home to the biggest UFC fights right now. From International Fight Week to championship fights all across the board, you come to T-Mobile. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one? Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the jump. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. He blocks the punch. Head movement, slips there. Looping left hand misses the target. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Oh, nice slip to avoid that right hand. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be, and if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's in coming. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. He's got the turnover in that kick. Stuffs that takedown attempt without issue. Ooh, head kick lands and he's hurt. Big ball punch lands. Now he gets back to range. And both guys really throwing with authority. Oh, my God. Oh, and there he goes working off that. I mean, the jab's nice. I love throwing the jab. But you realize that as MMA evolves, guys will start to fight behind a very educated jab. It's just like boxing. The most thrown punch in the first one you learn is a jab. Right. And in MMA, guys are starting to take that same approach because it is such an effective weapon. Lee's hook shot blocked. That one was telegraphed. Good job by the defense. And he landed the right hand there. Beautiful strike. Very nice leg kick for him there. Can't take too many of those. That right hand hurt him a little bit. Just out of range with that right hook. Punch coming, it's blocked. Got clip with the right hand. Oh, misses with the jab. Big leg kick lands. All right, so he continues to land that patented jab and keeping his opponent at bay. You can know that it's coming, but until you're in there with him, the speed and the power of that jab is something you can't really prepare for. Trying to establish that jab once again. Nice head kick. Oh, nice elbow. He loaded up with that right hand, too. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Big left hook coming, it's blocked. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Thirty seconds now to go in round one. Just unable to quite find that range. Big body kick. 
final seconds here of round one. Well, he continues to find the openings tonight. Beautiful connection with the punch there. Accuracy at its best. All right, so we now look back at some of the action from that previous round, DC. A lot of good highlights on both sides. I mean, a lot of good highlights from both competitors. They both should be very proud of what they accomplished. But I'm telling you, man, I'm not sure they can keep this up. If they land at this clip for another five minutes, somebody's going to sleep. All right, we'll see how it goes here in this next Ready? round. A high Ready? number of kicks Go landed there in the previous round. And at some point, these are really start to take it. They do start to take an effect whenever you're taking kick after kick after kick. And watching him fight with that knowledge and that patience shows his fight IQ. Big punch land. Ooh. Time the shots pretty well here early, DC. He's doing a great job of mixing things up, keeping busy, being very accurate. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Liver kick. Connects with a right. Going back to his patented kicks here, but unable to find the target there. Oh, he lands a huge kick here. Oh, straight right. Trying to find a home for that right hand. Great punch landing with so much power. Man, he's just got a great feel for the striking realm early in this one. The timing is on point. He's doing a great job of mixing everything up. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, hey. if you're gonna sit there at the drive-thru, order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, give him the hook behind the right hand. Jab, right hand, hook, that's two pieces of chicken and a biscuit. Finish him off with the uppercut. That is your soda. I mean, come on, man, let this guy have the whole thing. Three minutes now to go in this one. On, Trying to kick the leg out. Nice strike. Well, eventually you know he's gonna turn this defense into offense, but he's certainly doing a nice job on the defensive end thus far. They talk about the feeling out process. He's getting his opponent's timing. Now he's blocking everything. Expect counters as we go forward. So a much different approach from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He has found it here, and as a result, has really picked up the pace in round two. That is a stiff jab. The guard lands the right hand. Oh, that's a pretty filthy combination there by Lee. And they separate. You wonder if the offensive fighter's gonna start to get frustrated here. Most stiffed on all these shots are getting blocked. They're getting blocked because he's fighting one of the best defensive fighters in the UFC. Oh, he lands another strike to the body. He just continues to punish his opponent's midsection here in this round. Good punch, Lance. Oh, how about that? He lands a huge kick. Superman punch now. Both guys landing with conviction now. Lee's kick is blocked. Just misses with the jab. There's no give on that leg kick. Nice super punch. Oh, combination lands. You want to talk about putting strikes together. Beautiful execution. And every one of them are landing. He's overwhelming him with different attacks. Single collar tie now. Kick to the body by Lee. Timing his shots nicely.
obviously good tempo, very accurate, finding the range with relative ease. Yeah, he's doing a great job of really overwhelming his opponent with activity. Tried to set up the straight left, but he missed. 20 seconds to go round two. Oh, and he continues to pour it on. We mentioned earlier the aggression with his striking. Gotta be careful to knock gas out here, but at least you have to admire the approach. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. And they separate. What a round it was, and how about that flying Superman punch at the end of the round? Not a lot of fighters will try it. He did, he executed. And it worked, right? No discouragement from his opponent to make him not try it. Why not try it? It's working, so why not try it again? If his opponent isn't careful, he will get knocked out and be on a highlight reel for the rest of time. All right, DC, buckle up. Here we go with our next round. High number of kicks landed in the previous round, and he'll look to keep it going here. He'll look to keep winning the fight with his kicks. He's throwing high kicks, leg kick, body kick. He's even throwing a couple spin kicks in there. This guy is so educated with fighting with his legs. Well, just as he did in the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Man, look at the redness starting to appear on the left side of his body. His opponent would be wise to continue to attack there. Right hand upstairs! All right, so a good job by him here. He continues to block these shots. Seems to see them coming a mile away. He sees them coming a mile away, and he's blocking, he's rolling, he's slipping. He's doing a great job. I mean, he's cutting them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Oh, he landed another great shot to the body there. Really starting to connect at a high percentage now in the latter stages of this fight. Kick. Didn't see that one coming. That one was thrown to end the fight. Yeah. <laughs> what a fight we got going on here. Just over three minutes to go in round three. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Left hand punch in the clinch. Oh, he's really starting to apply pressure on his opponent here. Different approach here in the last couple rounds, and it's the exact sense of urgency that you want to see from a fighter take the judges out of it. DC didn't take him long to find his range here tonight, huh? His timing is on point. Sound defensively blocks the shot. Oh, nice slip there. It sounds simple, right? Hit and don't get hit. But this guy's defense has been sharp tonight. Cat and mouse. You got to play cat and mouse. Hit and don't get hit. He does a great job of that. Misses again. This fight's going to be over. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high. He was going low. And now he's got him hurt very bad. Nice punch lands over the top. Both fighters throwing heat now. Oh, that's a good right hand. Nice body kick right under the elbow. Oh, big right hook, but a whiff. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively. Oh, huge right hand! Start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. And able to avoid the punch there. Nice slip by Lee. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. Hook 
shot attempt to the head here. Instead, it's blocked by Lee. Behind, down. That one snuck in. Nice strike. Takedown defense holds up. Well, he's looking for that left hand. Just out of range, though, with it. Oh, he continues to land a high number of strikes in this round. Really? Right there. I'm not sure his opponent knows where he is. No, he is on B Street right now. He's seeing Tweety Bird over the top of his head. When you take a hook like that, you are on wobbly legs. Back and forth we go. Well, one got through. That kick was blocked. What a punch. Spinning back fist, didn't see that one coming. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Beautiful body kick. Right on the button. Well, he has certainly found the range and staying pretty busy here. He's being busy, but it's also the timing and the accuracy that's allowing him to land so many attacks. That's Great three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship round. All right, well, that's the end of the round, so the location is okay, the cut on the cheek, but that is some serious blood trickling out of that cut there. You gotta think maybe at some point they call the doctor in, and if he doesn't like what he sees, maybe they stop this fight. All right, so there's the end of the round, and on one side, thrill on the other agony after that knockdown. Yeah, he was able to really damage him with that big punch. You see the hands, the speed, how sharp he is, how technical he is. It allows him to land in spots where his opponent is winging punches. Great strike landed. Great punch landed to put his opponent down. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Good right hand right there. Oh. Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Wow! His opponent squirming like a fish out of water now. The ground and pound is on point. This could very well be the beginning of the end. This could be the beginning of the end. We've seen some really good ground and pound fighters. This young man is as good as any we've ever seen. Big kick land. No surprises, he connects once again, and that looks like it landed right on that cut. Right on the cut, and he's targeted it, right? He's looking, you can see him almost putting a laser beam on that cut and just putting his hands on it. It doesn't take much, he's just keeping oh. it. He's in trouble, he's hurt bad. Oh, he might be out. Caught with that punch. Sneaky head kick. Big power shot there. A oh, really good job by him there to raise the guard, DC, and block those shots coming his way. He does a great job of blocking all incoming strikes. Nice one, two there. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Slips the punch. Just out of the range with that right hand. Look at the torso on the right side. Major bruising, and it's only getting worse. That one appeared to stun him. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. Oh! He's out! He's done! He's done! <laughs> yeah, there's another one for the highlight reel, and that's probably as good a knockout as he's had in the UFC. Just a Perfect shot to end the fight. Crowd absolutely loving it. Flush land to close out his opponent. I'm not even sure the other fighters saw it coming. So a big knockout for him here tonight on the biggest of stages. So there he is after a monumental knockout turned in here tonight.